Hey guys, we are one week out. Um, this is the final leg workout for this whole entire prep. Uh, we're going to be hitting some quads and a little bit of hamstrings. So I'm going to take you guys through it. Uh, we're a little bit depleted still, still feeling it, a little bit drained, but we're going to get through it. we got one more week and then it's show day. So follow me through this leg workout, guys, and I hope you guys enjoy it. First exercise is going to be just some hip abduction and adduction. We're just warming up the, uh, the adductors and abductors. Um, it's also very important because it builds the size, you know, inside your legs rather than just opposed to, you know, all the compound pushing movements. It actually focuses on the details in your inner quads. So, very important guys. I know a lot of girls do this or there's that misconception that it's a girl exercise, but if you're a bodybuilder, super important. So, adduction, abduction, uh, two sets of each. 15 to 20 reps, warm it up. Okay, so the next exercise for today, our first compound movement, is going to be the Smith Machine Split Squat. Uh, we're going for two to three warm up sets, same idea as every other workout where you know, five to six reps, even though you can get 10 to 12, save your energy for the working sets. And then we're gonna hit two working sets, uh, just straight sets on this. Uh, being the first exercise, we're not gonna do too much intensifiers or anything, so we'll get to it, and then you guys will see what's next on the, uh, on the menu. Let's go. YouTube, your discretion, but when you're training, don't be walking around with your invisible flat syndrome with your arms flared out, hopped on a bunch of D-ball and 3,000 tests, thinking you got some muscle when it's all water, and then you got your girlfriends who just blab away the whole time rather than do any work and actually train hard. So. Keep that shit away from Olympia. Don't bring that shit here. Okay guys, next exercise, we got the circle leg press. Uh, this is a great movement to really uh, hammer out your quads and isolate the quads. Um, the main things you want to focus on this are just controlling the weight, full range of motion, all the way down and all the way up. You don't want to be swinging or using any momentum. Uh, that will cause some serious damage to your lower back and your knees, so. Constant tension throughout the movement. We're gonna do two warm-up sets, uh, two to three working sets. We'll probably do either a drop set or maybe a rest pause. We'll see how we feel. Um, everyone's really instinctual right now, based off of uh, you know being depleted and uh, that's the last week of training. So we'll see how I feel. We'll probably do a drop set on the last set, and uh, let's get it. Cool. Oh. One more. 
one of the main things that me and Joe have been trying to uh, really bring in for this prep, especially for the, the national qualifier, is uh, getting my glutes and hamstrings really crispy and dry. Um, I feel like the first show we did, which was four weeks ago, um, we looked really good. We brought a really good package, but um, I felt like my glutes and hands could have been a lot more dry. And if we were to bring that in, I think things would have been, you know, that extra little notch up. So um, this time around, we're like 10 pounds lighter from stage weight. And I feel like they're a lot more dry and they're, they're finally coming in. So I'm really looking forward to seeing on, on what we bring to the stage in a week. So, and we haven't really did any, uh, you know, uh, used anything in terms of like, to pull water or you know any little tricks up our up our sleeves to to really make them dry and condition so i feel like I, that was the one thing i was worried about going into my first show and even though it still looked great and after we pulled the water they still look good this time around they're a lot more drier and we haven't pulled any water yet so let's see what happens all right guys so final working set uh we're going from the plates aside uh 10 to 12 reps, bang it out, focus on the, you know, quad. Um, and then we're gonna drop it and just go to failure and see how many we could get. Uh, it's on to the next exercise, so let's bang this out. Let's do it. All right. Triple drop set, guys. We did, did, did a little on the fly change. Mid set. Went from a regular drop set to a triple. Just because it's the last leg day. When I'm on that stage, I don't want to think, fuck, I should have done more. Next exercise for today is the hack squat. Uh, this is the Atlantis hack squat. Uh, it's a really good, smooth machine. Um, we're gonna load it up and go pretty heavy. This is one of our main compound movements along with the vertical press. Uh, and there's gonna be a front squat after this. So uh, we're gonna do two warm up sets, maybe three warm up sets and work our way up. And then on our final working set, we'll probably do a rest pause or maybe a back off set just because I ended up doing a triple drop set on, uh, on the vertical press. So we'll do that and see how we feel today. So let's get through it. I got biscotti and froze it. Big boss like I'm Rose. Ice it when he's at the dome. Low baddie and she homemade. Rap my city at the home game. Up and down and go both ways. And it's spinning and taking up both ass. Hop in, we zoom in, the package be booming. Yeah, we got it, we got it, got it. She picking and choosing. We'll go for another, another five to six. See how it feels. Work her up to five with like a back offset or a rest boss. 
see how everything just feels. It's all, it's all just instinctual right now. Let's go. Oh. All of my bros, we got it, got it. They know for sure we got it, got it. Been on a roll, we got it, got it. We cannot go without it, out it. Mess with the squad, you try to try to go against us. I highly doubt it. Been on a roll, we got it, got it. We cannot go without it, out it. I be on exotic, can't mess with the toxic, curvy little body, be all on it. Keeping it spicy, you know that I got it. If she need it, just call on me. Run up the tag, run in the bag, no mama, get it. Call on me, ride with me, we gon' fall. Then we zoom in the package, we go, yeah, got it, we got it, got it. She picking and choosing and love with the moment, yeah, we got it, we got it, got it. They cannot do what we doing, you see how we do it, we got it, we got it, got it. Mess with the squad, you try to try to go against us, I highly doubt it. All of my bros, we got it, got it. They know for sure, we got it, got it. Been on the road, we got it, got it. We cannot do it without it, got it. Mess with the squad, you try to try to go against us, I highly doubt it. for another 10, rest 15 seconds, try to bang out as many as you can get, maybe five, maybe six, rest another 15, and then however many you can get again. It's essentially just four reps with 15 seconds rest in between three times. This is gonna hurt. We'll go for eight to 10, rest 15 seconds, and then just a failure for the other two sets. Let's go. Take it live, live from a place where nobody else know to take it. They hand up, they want us to spit the pie, pie, right? Because they realize that we gone crazy. Yeah, I flip my pie, really did that 180. Yeah, excuse me. I flip my pie, really did that 180. Young niggas coming to you lie, lie from a place where nobody else know to take it. They hand up, they want us to spit the pie, pie, right? Because they realize that we gone crazy. Yeah, I flip my pie, really did that 180. Yeah, excuse me. I flip my pie, really did that one day. Who's that gon' tell me I can't do it? I can't do it. Better be on time with my bankroll. My bankroll. Oh. Y'all fat, no ball cat, no lit word. No lit word. Routine like clockwork, my wrist word. My wrist go like this. I flourish to cook, I no roof on it. I'm talking, I'm all in the moment. Everything that I don't miss. Tell someone get John on the last hit, the invoice is cut. Two checks of that call. Number 15. A little finger count. Fuck a timer. Let's go. Last one. Hack squats. We're gonna move on to front squats now. Plate loaded front squats. We're probably just gonna do two to three warm up sets, two working sets, straight sets. 15 reps, high reps on that one. This one. Man, I remember like when I was younger, or like, let's just say, few years ago or whatever, right, the way it used to be. I'd always see people who would compete or would have friends compete, and I was like, I can never do that. Like, I can't do that shit, you know what I mean? And then fast forward, here we are, did one show already, which I never thought I would ever be able to do one, you know? It turned out all right, and now we're doing a fucking national show, which is crazy, so. Just progress, you know? Setting little goals every year. You know, and then those small goals eventually become big goals, you know, and big things and big success. They all add up, right? And then before you know it, you look back and you're like, holy shit, I'm actually doing it. And then, you know, it's like, look where I'm at. But that whole journey and that whole process, you don't really realize it as you're going through it. So it's crazy how the world works and how things work. And 
I guess people who set goals and, and just go after them, how, how things just change. So anyways, guys, on to the next exercise. Um, we're gonna do front squats, plate loaded front squats. Um, main thing is you want your feet about shoulder width. Uh, we're going for 15 reps, high reps, get a lot of blood flow in there. We already hit it pretty heavy with the vertical press, along with the hack squat and the split squat. So the quads are, the quads are pretty shot. So 15 reps, get all the blood flow in there. Uh, you want to be slow and controlled always. Uh, no swinging, no, mo no momentum. Um, and then we're just going to do maybe two warm-up sets, two working sets, straight sets. Uh, you know, no intensifiers, nothing like that. And we'll just bang it out. So let's get through this, guys. We're almost there. We're almost done. I see you move through the base, they precaution, they snake they see me money tree, wake up the royalties. I got a queen, yeah, she go with me. She making me feel like I'm royalty. It's probably cause we rug. I just got fresh with the golden piece, shrug, show the emoji. Okay, you know it's me, diamond soul dancing, singing like Joe to see 10 out of 10 every time till they notice me. What you thought I was supposed to do? <laughs> Ain't nobody close to me. Granted, my hands touch the billboards and they printing my face on the billboard. They envy my drip, I'm enlightened. You should let go where that hate, but you feel more. I make them rage every time they get flamed when they hear what I say coming straight from the source, yeah. I come a long way from the go by the shore. My boy, I'm a turn. i you lie, lie. From a place where nobody else never take it. They hand up, they want us to spit the pie, pie, right? Because they realize that we gone crazy. Yeah. I flip my pie, really did that one night. I flip my pipe, really did that one day. Can't tell me what I can't do. Better be on time with my bankroll. Tall fat, no ball cat, no lip work. Routine like pipe work, my wrist work. How about the new thing going crazy? They be like, look, girl, that's Xavier. Under the sauce stuff, I'm gravy. Sweet on the boat, shoes, that's wavy. Chief Rocker, young drop topper, got the off stopper, that's Mando. Ain't Ned fing with me, but I see him doing what he can do. And I came in this with the ruffians loaded, I'm buffering, flexing, I'm buff again. Winning, they know that I'm up again. Talk like he busting, I know he gon' bluff again. Sweat suit with the suede on it, not a stain on it, just a pack scene. Got a thing for the paper piles and the brown babies with the accent. And they know that it's really up. The coppers, we tear the whole city up. Hit the stage and she holding them up. About to flip me a honey, put 50 up. They be popping that for the internet. They want an Oscar, I'm cool on the fakery though. How you be doing the most when you doing the least? They be loafing on bakery mode. Final movement for today for the quads will be leg extension. Um, we're gonna be just doing one warm up set, feeling it out. Then we're gonna be doing a giant set, I guess you can say. So, what we're gonna do is basically try to hit 100 reps. Um, with the weight we could do about 30 reps for. Drop it one stack, go for another 30 or however many you can get. Drop it another stack, 30 or however many you can get, up until you get 100. So, this is something you don't really go heavy on. We've already hit the heavy movements. This is something you just want to isolate the quads, make sure you get a full range of motion and really squeeze everything out to bring out that detail. Um, so this is one of the finishers. And then we're on to calves, blast those really quick. And that's it guys. That'll be the last leg workout for this prep for the, the uh, Toronto National Qualifier. So let's do it. Let's finish it up. Right, guys, full range of motion all the way up, bring out the details all the way down. All those details showing straight up for the hip. Fucking burns. Uh. Last fucking leg work. Let's go.
Five over 30, 16, 17, 18, 14, 20. Legs are fucked, guys. <laughs> That's when you know. All right. <laughs> so that concludes the final leg workout of this prep for the uh, Toronto Pro Qualifier. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. Got some good tips out of it. Got some uh, good footage. Uh, it was a grinder. You know, we're pretty depleted, but we managed to get through it. And uh, I was pretty happy with it, being the last leg workout of, of the prep. So before you guys know it, I'll be up on stage and uh, we'll see how the placings go. But whatever happens, happens, guys. I'm, I'm happy with anything, so. Just being able to do this alone and, and being able to, to talk to you guys and show my physique and, you know, getting this all recorded and filmed is more than enough for me and it's, it's very um, self-rewarding, I guess you could say. So, thanks for watching, guys. Like, comment, subscribe.